What if I told you I was going to give you $1,440 a day, every day, for the rest of your life? Would you think, what's the catch? What if there wasn't a catch? Well, there's two things you'd have to do. The first thing is, you have to be at my house by 7 a.m. every day to pick it up. The second thing is, you have to spend it all in one day. So, does that sound interesting? Do you think you could do it? Well, you might be thinking, well, if you're going to give me $1,440 a day, yes, I can do that. But can you really do it, and for how long can you do it? Because you're going to have to give something up, right? What would you have to give up? Well, you have to give up your sleep, for one thing. You've got to be here by 7 a.m. every day. The other thing is you have to give up, what are you going to do with your days if you have to spend $1,440 every single day? Now, you could sit down and go on Amazon Prime and just start clicking some buttons, but after a while, maybe two or three weeks, don't you think you would grow weary a little bit? Because you'd have to give some other things up. Do you really have to give things up? I think you do. So for instance, let's just take dieting, for example. If you're trying to diet and you say, I am going to eat a bowl of ice cream every night for the next 30 days, what do you think you're going to have to trade off at the end? At the end of 30 days, you're not going to fit in your jeans. That's what you're going to have to trade off. So you have to decide, what is it that you want? Because there's always a trade off. What are you willing to give up? And what are you willing not to give up? Let me tell you a quick little story. When I was in my 20s, I had an opportunity. While I was in high school and college, I always worked in the restaurant business. And I had an opportunity to get a job at this really nice restaurant, very fancy. Famous people were going to be coming to this restaurant. And so I was super excited. You had to have a lot of experience to get the job. So I was super excited about it. But as those things go, the building had delays. They weren't opening. Weeks were going by. And what happened was I ended up having to do little odd jobs here and there just to be able to work. And then I was out with some friends one night, and I met someone, and he was the area manager for a coach store. Coach, like the pocketbook coach. And he started talking to me. And he said, hey, have you ever thought about going into retail? Have you ever thought about managing your own store? And I thought to myself, well, not really. I mean, you know, I make really good money. I make really good tips. He said, why don't you come in for an interview? So I did. I went in the next day for an interview. And he said to me, look, you're going to have to give up making those big tips every night. But for that sacrifice, eventually you're going to have a career. You're going to move up with the company. And you're probably going to have your own store. So I thought it over. And I thought, OK, I'm going to do this. I'm going to get a real job. So I was super excited about it. Well, about a week went by, and I got a phone call. And that's back when the phones were on the wall, you know? <laughs> I picked up the phone, and guess who it was? The restaurant. Hey, we're opening up Friday night. You start Friday night. I literally was walking out the door for training for my new job at the coach store. So I had a decision to make. Was I going to do what was comfortable? the quick fix, the quick money, or was I going to go for the long haul for a career? Well, I did take the restaurant job. I did end up regretting that eventually, but that's another story for another day. Now, you're probably not going to get anybody to offer you $1,440 every day for the rest of your life. But do you know what gift you do have? You have 1,440 minutes every day to use. Two things you have to do. You have to be alive, <laughs> and you have to use it all today. There's no tomorrow. Whatever you do today doesn't roll into tomorrow. We all get 1,440 minutes. And we have choices of what we're going to do with those minutes. What are you going to do with yours? You know, we don't always get what we want, but we always get what we choose. <laughs>